my name is Salo Gonzalez. I'm the director of the Tenant Landed Junior Programs at Elite Sport Club Brookfield. I'm here today to show you some exercises that will help your kid to, to have a better, uh, to perform better on the court. All what you need is a tennis racket, some cones, and some tennis balls. So let's go and get it started. On this video, we're going to be talking about how your kid can control the ball, either it could be a cross court or down the line direction. So I'm going to demonstrate. First of all, I'm putting some targets on the other side. As you see, we got a yellow uh, targets and white targets. So I'm going to tell my, uh, my player, in this case your, your kid, to just throw the ball and remember, we want to have the, the sideways position, you will want to have throwing the ball on the side of their body. And in this case, we're going to try to throw on the yellow, yellow cones. So in this situation, the kid is actually throwing the ball down the line, even, even know that he doesn't even know what is the down the line uh, direction or shot. So if I tell him to go to the white cone, he's going to try to figure it out because that's, that's the key to figure it out, to figure out how do you get to the, to the white cone. So eventually your kid is going to get a little bit more rotation of the body and we can do the same thing on the back and side. On the back and side, we want to have, of course, facing sideways, facing to the opposite way, with two hands holding nice and gentle. And first, we start with the wide cones as a down the line direction, and then we go cross score to get to the yellow cones and direction. So step number two is with your racket now, and of course you want to be in a sideways position, and you want to hit the contact on the side. Now the first step, will, uh, the first idea will be hitting the ball cross court, which is going to be on the white cones, and just easy to tell your kid, just hit it on the white cones. He's going to figure out how to hit it. We can teach and probably hit the ball maybe a little bit early with the face of your racket facing over there. So this looks something like this, but eventually he or she is going to. Um, figure out how to get to that point there and the same thing with the down the line as you see we're hitting on those cones and we try to hit it down the line too the beauty with the cones is that the kid can understand the the limitations of the court now we are on the 36 foot court which is a very small court and we put some targets on the other side the kid has is going to have more control of the ball and of course more direction as well Step number three, it will be more interaction between you and your child and it will be pr probably, you know, you on the other side in a cross court situation, standing on the other corner and try to maybe toss in the ball to your child and try to your kid to hit it back to you in a very easy pace or probably you can use a racket and use back and forth with a racket as well depending on the level. Thank you for watching.